Oh, Everything is happening oh, so much. <laughs> there we go. Need to stop that. Ugh. I need to click on this so my OBS window would actually capture it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I was going to say, <clears throat> actually capture it. <laughs> okay. Air today, gone tomorrow. Get it? Oh, is he really gone tomorrow? He left the house. He's gonna come back. Maybe. Uh, and not if we have anything to say. About <laughs> <it>. <laughs> Restore. Yeah, we'll find out. Uh, we're on it. the next page, I think. Oh no, no, it is. I'm poofing it. Yeah, because I brought us here. Hey, what's up? It's me. <laughs> that was September. Hey. We get those subs. It's not like $1 subs. Like, <gasps> oh, oh, hey. No, it's on, actually 30%. Impressive. I wonder if I have to resub to you. The denseness it's a new of month and everything. Oh, hold on. Before you do. I don't remember this man having an echo. Is it because it's you're listening to both audios? Yeah. Oh, shit. The video. Yeah, I forgot about that. It's I cool. to turn that off for mute and me. Oops. September uh, is here. September is here. Thirty cool. percent off subs, which means there we go. You can get a foot long for uh like three dollars and twenty cents or something like that. Yeah, you know. Hi, Tars. Those foot longs we get from Twitch. <laughs> I'm assuming hey, that Tars. cat is waving at me. There is no reply. It's too bad. Oh man, I One wish second. Uh, I'll just walk it around here. Funny if the man was in an echo chamber. <laughs> I like that cat. It's a good cat. The denseness of the forest makes it inadvisable. I need to, to make those icons. Yeah. I think I just have empty things waiting there. Um put a golden banana. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I guess that'd be Steve, but then again, I have this. Oh, yeah, you started that. Yeah. This magic yeah. map. <laughs> yeah. Like, okay, sure. Whips out. Well, that took a long time to load, but six days. So next week. Next week okay. we'll resub. And then we oh. can see explosions and stuff. Nice. What am I doing? Where am I going? I don't know. What uh, are you doing? Go, go. I don't, the there's only one place, one Alexander way to go. Go up. Out. Oh, I didn't know oh. if we needed to go. <laughs> Alexander pulls out, and I'm like, oh dear. Uh, you could click on the sand to not go anywhere. Apparently, the map won't teleport its user anywhere except the other islands. It's a good thing, too. Alexander has had enough of ocean swimming lately. I had escape. Uh, get a click on the sand. Sand. Like off okay. the map. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, go ahead. There you go. Sploosh, sploosh, sploosh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and... Woo -woo. Oh, this guy. You remember the statue? Yeah. It's still alive, so... Let's see what we have. Throw a tomato a stone home. archer would undoubtedly shoot Alexander long before he managed to climb up the stone. Climb up? Uh, you just toss the, it at his the, face. The, the oh, you had this as a kid, Tarks. So did Ryan. We never played. Yeah, mm -hmm. we never played these. What is this? It's an eye? Uh, that's the sacred water that the, the winged would... one uh, lady gave you. Okay. Oh, wait. Alexander decides to pass through the gate, preparing the shield just in case. The magic arrow completely shatters the shield. Good thing the arrow didn't hit Alexander. Nice. We did it. Puddling. Is he gonna like um, go ahead me? and no, no, you you've solved it. Um, go ahead and put your hand on the roses and pick a white rose. 
Alexander takes a magnificent white rose from the rose hedges. Yeah, I like these Sierra games. I don't know. I like I like adventure games even though. But I never played this one when I was a kid. I was all about these games as a kid. Yeah, Ryan had to, played those. We had to upgrade our computer to a better graphics card for this game because it oh, would wow. always crash as soon as we entered the catacombs. Oh yeah, that's what you're saying. No, no. How do you get through? The dagger. Cut. The dagger isn't strong. Fuck you. But you have the right idea. The scythe. Mm. Alexander wields the scythe, determined to get past the magical rose hedges. It's nice that they give you a little. The leaves fly as Alexander tries to cut the branches. Happy sound as if you get it together. right. Cast yeah. firebolt, says Tark. <laughs> <laughs> We it's didn't true. I mean have a lot of these honestly. games as a kid. No, that's what I was saying. What the fuck? Center Beast Garden. My name oh. is Alexander. I didn't mean to disturb your private garden. No. And yet, monsieur, you could hardly have accidentally broken. Oh, it's the beast from Beauty and the, the Beast. Of the Isle of the beast. Um I I suppose it is simply my nature to break through enchanted traps. <sighs> my nature to be an asshole. I know the nature of princes all too well. This face you see before you is hideous, is it not? Well, it's fine. For Dude, the you look great. Of a beast, you should be like. It is really. You are I handsome. No. Wink. Ha! I'm glad you like it, for you will soon own one just like it. I too was once a pretty prince, caring for nothing but adventuring pretty and prince. rescuing fair maidens. <laughs> but I rankled one too many evil hags. One dark this was the first game with Hollywood casting. This wow. You see before you. Huh. He kind of sounds like uh, Brian Cummings. On this enchanted island over a hundred years. No, he doesn't. Surely there a little bit. Is a way off this island. Oh, surely. You broke in, did you not? And yet think. Where would I go? A little bit of Sokolov in, in there. So eloquently hmm? A little bit of Sokolov in there. Silk and this He's a king, though. You see, my prison is also my yeah, castle. I don't know. You are the first to break through the barriers in low these many years. That is, except for the druids who stole my heirloom coat of arms. If there's any way I can help. Help? Damn you? those druids. I'm afraid you don't understand. The enchanted barriers were a warning and protection for you more than for me. Your prize for Oh, uh, I hear where you're hearing it now. Join me in this dire life. Mm -hmm. By the laws of this sorcery, you are doomed What's this to be area on him? in the form of a beast. Your reward for broken <laughs> this this little kerchief? Oh dream. yeah, I guess. <laughs> a slave as beastly as I am. You have only a few hours of humanity left. But that's not possible. There must be some way to break the enchantment. Spells always have a weakness somewhere. The enchantment you are under is tied to my own. Oh, the sorceress left me a way out. But I'm afraid it was All only right. her final bitter joke. You see, I need only find a maiden to join me here. To share my castle, my life, willingly. Take another look at me. You can't help but admire. Boy, you'd have no problem in 2020. Cruelty and I know, right? <laughs> Who wants to have my giant castle with a giant furry? There'll be a line of people. I know, right? My last few hours as a man on an impossible errand. However, okay. Alexander is voiced by Bobby Benson, who played Beast in Beauty and the Beast. Oh, no way. Only heirloom I have left. If perchance you should Can he become the beast? If you think you have found a maid. Right? Uh Alexander? Yeah. I shall yeah. give her Uh this, this is a timed yes. event from as soon as this conversation you. stops. By doing so, I don't know exactly how long. It's probably like 10 to 15 minutes, okay. but it your time um short. Count the minutes on your fingers. But yeah, while you it, it is you if you don't succeed, you die. Your master will await you. I think you turn into a beast. Well, know. even if you turn into a beast and you had a lady friend come over, wouldn't the spell technically be broken? I think 
I don't... Well, it depends. I think you turn into, like, not an intelligent beast. Oh. Well, good thing we walk super fast. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. It's the best. I know in King's Quest 7, um, they did one of these timed events and timed Alexander it to... pulls out his magic map. Um... How fast, like your the CPU, the clocking mechanism might yeah. be or something. Yeah, and it made it so anytime you played on a game or a computer that's like nowadays, you have to start like you have to like go in <laughs> and like undo like yeah, a you have clock to slow down the CPU clock. Yeah, yeah. Where Otherwise, should I go? Yeah, just... Um, I will tell you, Isle of the Crown. Alexander feels a strange pulling sensation. Mm. My dick! <laughs> no! Oh <my laughs> Alright, well... Oh, hey, we know somebody. Hey, birdie, birdie, bird. The, the um, boatman. You can stop at the... Uh... Day, Prince Alexander. Back for more mints? Don't we have the mint to give him? No. No. Well, you have yeah. that. You don't give it to him. I mean, you could go to the bookstore, though. You'll talk to Jalo. You have time. <clears throat> I saw a picture of his other face. Jalo, my Whoa, he just went straight Is there. The wedding still moving Jalo, my love. The Prince Alex, he... Yes, yeah, his normal face, like in the old. Whole castle a bustle. Look, I didn't come here to talk about that, though. I came to war. Shallow warn face, warn King's Quest about what? Isn't the wedding bad enough? No. Listen. I can't believe Josiah the Senate is in this game. Here, Alexander. <laughs> he's posted extra guards, and he's telling them about a foreign saboteur. Who else could he mean but you? The wizard's G yeah, must and have learned Jalo's presence in the land, Prince Alex. Old face was much more not red. He must have. I haven't exactly been yeah, he looked like a normal guy Alexander, in the last in the older one. Oh, Everyone's a little Fred pink. Will never let you get close to Kasima now. He stumbled the castle guard, probably to make they sure are now. you keep For some reason. Like in the one before. Oh, it's too they weren't as pink. No, they weren't. I think it's just rendering. No, it's not. No, it's People art style completely. <laughs> it's a weird... Might be able to get close enough to... It's weird how different these no, I meant, are. Like, what an interesting art... Thought. I meant rendering as in, like... The, the rendering they used to... Alhazred brought Shamir with him when um, he came to this kingdom. What do you call it? Shamir probably won't do Shamir it. Shamir's a But that doesn't mean he isn't dangerous. He can be a terrible trickster and an ingenious spy. It's too bad we can't get our hands on Shamir's lamp. Why can't I think of the word that I need to use? I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. Would be <laughs> Wouldn't that be a fine thing? Palette? You would wish to be master of such a wicked No, creature? it's like Shamir is necessarily evil. Genies never Whatever they used to um their own is hot for good or ill. Not configure probably a shining oh, shit. example. For an impressionable genie. Yeah, Jallo does look different, Tarks. So how do you propose yeah, we go like about Like inflated head. Lamp. What? Oh, Prince Alex, I was only dreaming. I mean, the lamp is heavily guarded. It would be easier to steal Alhazen's own This face would have scared me as a kid. Them. I would but stop playing right here. Lamp. But surely a clown's hands are quick and agile. Really? Well, yeah. Yes, they are. Really that ha that face right there, absolutely. But then Even with the voice? Almost Doesn't matter. And then, hmm. my poor neck. If the theft were detected. Oh, I see. Yes, well, there might be a slim chance, but only that. If you could find a replica of the genie's lamp, uh, an exact replica, I might be able to make the swap. I alone might get close enough, but I couldn't tell you what to look for. I caught a glimpse of it only once. I would know it if I saw it again, but to say even Alexander's art is different. Well, yeah, because he's like facing straight I forward in the original one, kind of like Jallo is. I, uh, mm. really must be going back to the castle. I don't think I'll be able to come back here. If and not many people had his portraits. On, well, it's yeah, Jallo does. Alexander does. 
No, I can see probably the beast did, sorry. I think. If you do ever make it to the I don't, castle, look me I don't think... <laughs> do Ooh, excuse me. Um, I, I don't think Goodbye, any of the gnomes did. Thanks for all your help. Or, or whatever those guys uh, on the Isle of Wonder, the scent people. Not many people had. Anywho, look yeah. at that pretty ring. Um... Beast's ring is made of pure, heavy gold and bears an insignia possibly related to Beast's princely past. What's heavy gold? I don't know, isn't gold pretty light? Yeah, there's a more fragile metal out of all of them. Yeah, Jallo. This is, oh, like... Oh, 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 oh. Just watching <laughs> him walk away makes me think, like, oh shit, was there something I'm supposed to do? Hello. Good day, mate. My name is Alexander. How do you do? I'm sorry, sir, but I'm not allowed to talk Ooh, to strangers. She didn't have a portrait. What about this ring? Uh, Excuse I don't me, think she'll mate, pay attention to but that. I have someone yeah. I'd like to tell you about. Please, sir, I'm not allowed to talk to strangers. Well, that's a bummer. Anyways. Stop getting her in trouble. <laughs> Alexander doesn't want to intrude on... Okay. Well, there's a you dude I think you'd really like is all. But, okay, fine. <laughs> I'll just pace here. <laughs> oh, the Beast's voice is the same guy who did the Ferryman. The one that we thought was... Um... Familiar. Mm. Is this where I'm supposed to be, Ryan? Yeah. Okay. Then you have what you need. Any ideas, Katie? Oh, sorry, I wasn't looking. Oh, to Alexander talk to her? Is carrying mm -hmm. a book from the... Um, Wait. give her the rose. This of course. Rose feels unusual. It's unusually soft. Let me just whip this out. Pardon me, maid. I hope you don't think me forward. But I see that you like roses. I thought you might, perhaps, like a fresh white rose. Alexander can see the conflict in the girl's pretty face as she fights between pretty. her distrust of him and her desire for the <laughs> white rose. The rose wins. Oh, I shouldn't, sir, but it is so lovely. I've never seen a rose of white. It looks so pale and delicate. Wherever did you find one of such a color? There are many hedges of them on the Isle of the Beast, and they grow together like magic. Oh, truly? What an adventure that must be to see them. But I Here, come here, and we can both so feel a strange pulling sensation. A stranger. <laughs> <laughs> no! Rose, though. Kind, sir. Only the best for you. Here's a Alexander ring. Alexander has a thought about the serving girl. He decides to bring up the subject of beast with her. Let me tell you about the place where the white roses grow. The Isle of the Beast is an. I told you I can't talk to nobody. There's a path running through <laughs> a deep forest. The path crosses three magic blockades, set to keep all visitors away. At the center lives a tremendous beast. Really. Magic oh, I know why the portraits are different. What kind of a beast? Is it very terrifying mm. and ferocious? Um, it is a beast that walks on two legs. The one that we're like playing right now is the, with the Windows of version of a our CD release. Wears clothes? Um, How is that possible? The other one is magical? the DOS version. Not magical. Enchanted. Hmm. Beast was once a prince, but a witch trapped him in the form of a beast. So crazy they would do oh, two sets of art. There he lives Actually, it says the introduction cutscene is different in each version of the game. Oh, wow. <laughs> Which is the DOS 16, DOS VGA, DOS VGA CD, Windows CD, and Mac version intros are all different. Sometimes the script is different. I think I also prefer the DOS art tarks. Mm -hmm. There's just less of it. But it's, mm -hmm. this is fine. If I could, I, I honestly couldn't tell you if the script was any different from here to the other. Find comfort in a kind face. It was more, um, definitely I mean, more as a kid, I'm more or less. 
I think it's well, there was a lot of this back I and forth. Very much mm -hmm. think it's so. But um, you would as a kid, I really didn't you. read all Fred? of it. Maybe it like first. this part. I don't think I've ever read the but maiden's conversation with the beast so? or this. The roses in this little yard are the only magic I will ever see. I could take you there. In fact, I would owe you my life if you would go. If you truly wish to go. You are serious? I could leave here? Oh, I have always dreamt of leaving. But to actually go... This is the only home I have ever known. Home is a hard place to leave. Even if you're unhappy there. But I will go. If I can help him, I, I must go. She will be free. And you're just a slave anyway here, so... Yeah, I mean... Hey, can you hurry up? We're on a time limit. <laughs> no, you're taking too long! There is nothing. Then take this ring. Uh, actually, you're gonna have to give your two weeks first, and then... You will be then... pleased if you would wear it. <laughs> Why, it's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen! Thank you kindly, sir. Beauty! Where do you think you're going? Oh my god, that's a woman? To a place where roses grow. Okay, because it wasn't voiced before. I always assumed that was a man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got here. I see you wear my ring. What is that? You willingly agree. A weasel. What do you think it oh. is? With me? Do you know what that means? A lizard. Yes, my lord, I do. I have been touched. Is that genie? Pity alone. Is that another prince? It's king now. <laughs> oh, but it is a gentle face and kind. You know Ryan, do I have to get ready? So sweetly and are not repulsed. Ready for what? Like, is there like a... Something. Is this, is this, is this loser over here gonna attack, or is he just spying? No, he's just spying. Like he did when he was a snake that one time. Oh my god. I am oh my god. Okay. You, my oh my god! <laughs> Turn back into a beast! Please! Do you think that I learned nothing of true love during my time here? He looks like Mozart. My clothes. Wow, she looks better. How well it suits Does she? She yeah. looks like a balloon. I ever repay you? <laughs> I have you just gave her the lottery. My gratitude. I mean, we did. But please, take these old clothes. Perhaps you'll find someone in need during your travels. You have already repaid me by your example of courage, beauty. Uh -huh. And by your friendship. Beauty. You will always have our friendship and loyalty, Prince Alexander. But from a fellow adventurer, take some advice. If you find Stop. your true love, protect <laughs> you with your life. We're all beasts without the redeeming humanity of love. And to aid you, accept my Oh my god. Now that my life is this an after school story? Shadows, I have no need for it. Give it to someone with nothing to fear from the truth it reveals. Thank Thanks. you. <laughs> I wish you both were. Yeah, you would really grab that back. <laughs> Let me take you home. I think it's like a full-on, like, wall mirror, too. Like, he just walks around with that. <laughs> Throw Done. a dagger. Throw a dagger at him. Oh, right. No. Funk. Great. Um, so, actually, from here, we can technically end the game. Or oh, really? we could do it, yeah, with, uh, there's a castle, like, we could go to the castle and end the game. It's really bad ending, um, and you don't get all the points. Or we can continue and go to the last area and use all our magic spells, because we don't even use magic spells if we go now. Yeah, sure, well, we'll do the, the complete ending. Cool. I guess you could save here if you wanted to see the short one, like, if we have time or whatever, but... Trust me, it's just much better going the long way. Okay, we'll go the long way. Getting all the points. I already saved right before, so. Okay. Um, <laughs> the, let's the see. The Virgin Alexander. <laughs> That's what that walk looks like. Oh my god. <laughs> um, actually, um, uh, go back up and grab another white rose, and then we'll leave to the Isle of Wanda. Wanda. Alexander takes a magnificent white rose from the rose hedges. Alexander close. Oh. 
Okay. Socks are all wet. Uh, go ahead and use your hand on the maiden's clothes. Alexander searches through Beauty's clothes, but finds nothing. Hmm. Okay. Um, if you didn't have Cosima's hair, out. you could get a hair from that. But since you already have oh, Cosima's weird. hair, okay. I think that's why. Uh, um, one wonder. Wonder. Alexander feels a strain. To the Phallic Island. We're going to go talk to Bump on a log and stick in the mud. Right. Yay. Finally, they're kind of fun. Um, go ahead. And, I wonder if they have portraits. We'll find out. Um, go ahead and particularly use the teacup to try to get some swamp goo. Got yeah, look it. at that mirror. What do you think you're doing? You startled me. I was just getting some swamp ooze. Well, you certainly won't get it there! That's not swamp ooze! That's swamp sludge! He's right, you know. But he could be a little nicer about telling you he's not a very pleasant stick in the mud. Nobody asked you! Be quiet! <gasps> mm -hmm. Oh, the trials of being a mirror. Bump on a log. <laughs> what? Okay. Oh, they're making faces at each other. I'm like, what? Now we throw the dagger at the stick in the mud. Mm hmm. Sounds all right. Oh, that tomato. Perhaps I can help you out by throwing a rotten tomato at stick in the mud for you. Really? Oh, I appreciate the gesture, but the swamp is broader than it looks. Only a native like myself would be able to hit him from here. I'll just leave it in front of you. I thought this might come in handy the next time your brother starts picking on you. Aha! Finally, old bump on the logs not so defenseless, is he? Hey, hey! What are you doing there? Watch the pump, would ya? Now, Bumpy, remember all I've given you. The only thing you've ever given me is mud. Take this. No, not into the swamp. I'll get out of the way. Okay, okay, I give up. Jeez, sorry. An intense battle ensued. <laughs> well, I guess it's not very pleasant having things thrown at you. I'm sorry. You mean it? Really? Brother. Brother. Stick in the mud and bump on a log, exhausted from the battle, immediately doze off into naps. Rotten God, Tomato, being weird. equally lazy, decides <clears throat> to join them. Let's take some of that ooze. Oh, yeah. Yep. Alexander fills the teacup with the swamp ooze. Now we have to carry the it around. Ooze. With the swamp ooze. Swamp um, ooze. Swamp, swamp ooze. <laughs> uh, go ahead and go Yep, up north. And now... We want to get some salty tears for uh, our spells. This is what we're doing. We're collecting all the items for our spells. I see. So, um, what? Yeah. Alexander gives one of the baby's tears a bottle of milk. The other baby's tears seem to resent Alexander's gift for some reason. Is this supposed to be like baby's breath? Cabbage Patch kids? Uh, I, think I think Cabbage they, Patch? I That's think they what said I what it was. Teacup. Again? Yep. Why would Alexander want to put tears in a teacup? Oh. Uh, Why wouldn't he? The lamp on the crying baby's 
to oh, collect the salt water lamp. Oh, the, the not that the lamp. Skull. The um, the gold lamp. Yeah. Alexander collects some of the baby's tears in the old hunter's lamp. Okay. And then Great. there's one more thing you, here you need to grab, and then we can go. Table. Yep. Alexander picks up the bottle. What is it? A bottle. Go ahead and use it on him. Drink it me. It says drink me. Did I say it first? Uh, maybe sure. Alexander decides to swallow the potion in the bottle labeled Drink Me to see what happens. Here, eat these pills. Okay. <laughs> Suddenly, his vision fades to black. His lungs become too heavy to breathe. His heartbeat slows. Now oh, he's dancing. <laughs> he's got the music in his soul now. <laughs> He is the music. Then beats no more. Nice. Suddenly, his heart takes a lurch, then beats strong. It's just played backwards, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> <His chest laughs> like that of a newborn. What? His vision is he a clears, hummingbird now? Alexander feels fine. Phew. For a minute there, I thought, what if someone else had seen me and thought, sounds. <laughs> and thought, sounds. <laughs> um, now, is that just an empty bottle? No, well, it's got one more use. It some sort of potion and bears a label well, saying... Well, down the hat. <laughs> <laughs> yep, well, I'm still thirsty, so... <laughs> <laughs> um, go ahead and go to the chessboard. Remember, the queens were fighting who's got, who wants to give the coal? Yeah. To the for the wedding reception. Well, now you have another piece of coal. Oh my god! Look at my. You could give them so they both give coal. My army haircut. Yeah. <laughs> I think. Okay. There we go. Greeted, greeted by the queen every time you come here. Mm -hmm. The lump of coal shall be sent to the castle of the crown. I thought this was done because they walked away. <laughs> and that's all there is to it. <laughs> no, it shan't. Yes, it shall. If the coal is sent in your name, I shall royally decree a ban on all red on this isle. You do, and I shall royally decree that white shall be henceforth used for all mopping up of cabbage stew. You wouldn't dare! Oh, wouldn't I? Oh, it's you! Have you thought of any more of those brilliant ideas of yours? Let's give him a coconut gun, says Tarks. <laughs> <laughs> coconut gun. Uh, Coco, not done. Yes, why don't you take a look at yourself in the mirror? No, I don't know. Um, what if I were to give, give you the this rose feels un give you the rose? Perhaps you would take this and give the lump of coal to the White Queen. Of what value is that compared to this lovely lump of coal? Okay. You try my patience. So they don't kill me. No. <laughs> if I did it the other way. Perhaps this would make you as happy as that lump of coal you desire. That? You obviously don't know the mm. worth of a good lump of coal, young man. Show me not your trifles. Okay. I don't have a coconut gun. We have a coconut gun in our heart. <laughs> um... No! <laughs> um, there they go. Well, can't keep royalty's attention forever. That's true. 
He just stands there like, well, <laughs> shit. <laughs> Oh, good, they come back. Right away, actually. Yeah. Any thoughts, Katie? The lump of coal, your highness. Um, what do we have highness. in an inventory again? You shall give it to me, and I then... And what is it that... Um... What are they... What are they fighting over? The coal. Oh, they want coal? Mm-hmm. Well, one has coal, the other has a rotten egg to give for the wedding, and they both want coal. Knife the coal. Break that coal. Alexander tests the weight of the dagger. Nope. I don't think you can combine items in this. Ugh. No, you can. You but can? this isn't one of the cases. Okay. <laughs> yes, you can, but not in this case. <laughs> Burn the coal in the lamp. Oh, you just said I can't yeah. do anything. <laughs> <laughs> um, just chuck the coal over their heads and say, go get it. Horse. I don't know. I don't know, Ryan. Um, what, do, what, do, what do we do here? Well, the Red Queen already has coal. The White Queen wants coal, but we'll she just... only has a rotten egg. We'll give her so coal. So she wants coal, and you have coal yeah. to give. I thought you had to I choose between the yeah, two too. or something. So that you can stop fighting over the one you have. Oh, let me see. A lump of coal. And what I forgot where we got the lump of coal. Too. Got it oh. from the Isle of Mists. That's right. Can stop fighting, sister. Your highness can just keep <laughs> the old lump of coal, and I'll take this new one. Quite right. That settles everything. <laughs> As a token of our endless esteem and royal favor, please accept this magnificent and truly incredible spoiled egg. Nice. Uh. Uh. Thanks. Let me see that lump of coal, your highness. It is a beauty, isn't it? Why, it's bigger than my lump of coal. Let me have it immediately. Over my dead body, your highness, it's my lump of coal, and it is indeed larger and much grander. Just look at that sheen. I demand you exchange with me immediately. That voice sounds familiar, too. What are you going to do? <laughs> oh, wah, wah, wah. Uh, go back to the Isle of the Beast. Oh, I can go that way, I guess. <laughs> I don't know why he didn't follow the path. The monarchy pers persists. Alexander yes. Alexander. Mists. This one. Beast. No, Alexander no. Beast. Beast. No! <sighs> yeah, Don. Be bad. Fucked up. Yep. Oh, wow. Oh, man. We already saw that dying. Yeah, all right. Guess we got to do this again. Uh, you don't have to. He's wrong. <laughs> you got to tell <laughs> me this stuff it. earlier. <laughs> <laughs> you said the right. You said the right. Um, island. That was. I just, you just uh, do this so you can see what happens, but it gives you no points. Oh, okay. Then. Because how else would you know that? It's a potion that makes your heart stop, but comes back. Suddenly, his heart takes a lurch. Then beat strong. Uh, Tark's uh, posing the hard-hitting questions. Does the ruler of the Green Isles also rule over the Red and White Queens? His chest uh, like that of a yes. But there is no king and queen right now, and you. Princess Kasim is about to get married to the vizier, who we all know is evil. Um, and he has the, you know, intention of... Kissing. Ruling. Oh, no. Yeah, you can skip these ladies too. I cannot they skip have to have their this though. animation. I have to wait.
<laughs> Your Highness may never you. Oh, it's here. I found. The <laughs> That's how I remember the game, too. That's a very, um... I feel like that sound effect is in every single game ever made in the early 90s. <laughs> and there we go. Okay, now we go to the Isle of the Beast. Beast, of course. Why didn't you say so? I can feel your gaze. <laughs> yeah. You're like, miss? Okay, yeah, click. Then. They both end in ST, to be fair. Yes, yes. Beast. Mm -hmm. Alexander feels a strain. Now go all the way to the Beast's Garden again. I was gonna say, have any of you ever felt a strange pulling sensation? No. No. I can say I, I thought about it again. Firmly... Um. Okay. So go to your spell book. Spell book. Um. That is not that one. Of course. How it could is I? The V-shaped one. How could I? <laughs> and look at it. <laughs> 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 and we want uh, the next one. Uh, make rain spell. So this is what we're going to do. Few drops of salt water from the sea. You already put that in your in your uh, gold lamp. A vial of sacred water. We have that. And falling water. First mix the salt and sacred waters into the teapot. Okay, they call it a teapot. Then add the falling water. Okay. So you can uh, go out of this. We'll come what back if, to it very soon because we, we need to do the cast. It's not ready yet. Oh, okay. You need to actually do it before. Yeah. It. Um. So we'll put the sacred water into the teapot or the teapot into the sacred water. How would I go about... Mm, sacred water is the I one. Okay. And that into the teapot. Um, and now click the teapot and take it. They need falling water. So grab it from the fountain. Alexander doesn't need to do... Alexander fills the hunter's lamp to the brim with the fountain water. So wait, put the fountain water with the tears? Uh, the There's tears and the sacred water. Oh, that's the sacred... Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, now we will cast Alexander this one. Alexander prepares to enchant the hunter's lamp with the Make Rain spell incantation. I would not have thought to Clouds do this. Clouds of thunder, shafts of light. Although I guess, Come and suck thinking about meat. falling water, there's probably not Waters many places in this game with it. For tea. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I don't think they have any waterfalls. For me. Okay. Okay. I'm afraid to... Okay. The lamp in Alexander's hand gives a little perk. He hopes the spell works despite his makeshift teapot. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> uh, now we can go to the Isle of the Mist. Is that supposed to rain? No. No, you just prepared it. Oh, okay. There were, we were casting it. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. were casting it because um, to activate it, I think it says in the book, like, you need to make it boil. Oh, okay. Alexander pulls out his magic... <laughs> his magic what? The mist? Yeah, the mist. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alexander feels a strong... I think I felt a strange pulling sensation once. 
great gods. Did you see that? The man just appeared from nowhere. What's the big deal? We're Perhaps druids. It happens all the, the time. I see no boat. <laughs> he is an intruder, no matter how he got here. Grab him! Well, I guess our druids are more like magic with nature, right? Not again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look, I'll leave. It's no problem. I think not. Let's go. Yum. <laughs> Alexander is frozen at the spectacle before him. Robed figures are gathered around a bonfire. Some mystical... Ah, oh, another one! Just toss him in! <laughs> but as to its purpose, Alexander has no clue. We found a trespasser on the beach, Archdruid. Uh-oh. Not what he Arch sounded Druid. like on the beach. Yeah. <laughs> now what has Alexander wandered into? Shit, he left for the day. <laughs> this must be the foreigner we were warned about. How appropriate that he should come during our rain festival. Place him in the sacrificial cage. Wait! I must rescue the princess! There's an ancient druid saying, a man who would save others must first save himself. Alexander is pushed into the confining wicker cage. <laughs> I don't think that's how it goes. Oh, it is the mystery of the druids. Yeah. Except without the babies, but that's okay. And the cage is swung the out badly the rendered fire. babies. <laughs> what a fine mess we're in now. Alexander starts oh, man. to get a little warm. Pour the water on it. Can't do anything. The bottom of the cage is getting uncomfortably hot. This cage is really hot. Fire in what the cage. What if you have to go? Is that pee pee? Alexander pulls out yeah. Beauty's old slave clothes, desperate to beat out the flames. The flame is extinguished, but the clothes. Oh, it's one of these where if you don't have all the items, then Alexander you're... won't be able to keep the cage yeah. from igniting for long. Something will kill you along the way. <laughs> but I don't actually have to do anything. The heat and movement right. must have jarred something. Something that Alexander's carrying is starting to jiggle around. Alexander starts to feel a strange sucking sensation. <laughs> <laughs> no! Something's really percolating. The water in Alexander's lamp is hot. It's just about... boiling. <gasps> Alexander feels a drop. It starts to rain. You have to really pour to put that fire out. I mean, yeah. That man is a powerful nature wizard. By the sacred oak, let him down. I don't think they had <laughs> cheetahs like that in the druids. All right. Furious. Like okay. the north. I must apologize for our rude welcoming committee. We've been feeling inhospitable ever since the winged ones stole our sacred miniature oak tree. Besides, <gasps> Wizir Al Hazred sent a message that we were to watch out for a highly dangerous foreign assassin. I assume you are the one he meant. I'm sure I'm precisely who he meant. I assure you, I mean to harm no one, unless that person threatens the princess. I'm sorry to have disrupted your ceremony, but I'm running out of time. What is it that you seek? The Oracle on the Isle of the Sacred Mountain told me I should speak to you what? about the realm of the dead. <laughs> what is, is your quest? <laughs> I'm rusty, I might be able to free. Free souls in the realm of the dead? You're mad. The souls might be able to help me on my mission to save the princess. It's imperative that I do everything I can. The risks are not important. No. And yet getting yourself killed will hardly help the princess. The Virgin Alexander and the Chad Graham. Yes. <laughs> I was thinking about the Chad the Chad uh, meme with uh, with Graham and his little hat. In order to save his Oh yeah. Or the life and then the Virgin, uh, the Virgin Alexander with that little walking thing at the top left. So good. <laughs> I have only heard of one who tried it. A young knight who came to the land of the Green Isles from a distant land long oh? ago. According to the story, he was determined to challenge oh. the Lord of the Dead for the soul 
of his dead lover. Oh, it, it, it is said that he tamed the Lord of the Dead's horse, a black-winged, demon-hearted beast named Nightmare. Nightmare. I get it. Sometimes flies to the human world to feed Katie, on Katie, please, this is serious. <laughs> Whatever. Those unfortunate enough to see her. I'm just talking about the Chad Graham. Get a family. <laughs> <soars in doubt. laughs> Somehow, the knight captured Nightmare and rode off on her back, supposedly to the realm of the dead. But neither the knight nor his lover ever returned. If there was a means for challenge, it was lost with the night. I see. Can you tell me anything about the Lord of the Dead? The delivery oh, reminds me of the that is a black the uh, the Elder Martian in Santa Claus vs. the Martian. Samhain, the mm -hmm. Lord of coldness and despair. Oh, Lord Samhain of coldness. was once a man like you or I, but he insulted the gods and was sentenced to rule the underworld. Immortal he is and mateless. Robbed of sleep, robbed of movement, robbed of companionship. Horniness. It is said that he hates all mortals even more for the mortality that he lost. That is all I know. Interesting. I shall remember. Now look how the oak embers of our bonfire still glow hot despite the rain. If you're bent on your course, you'll need courage that's just as impervious to the chill. So like I said when I was a kid, I never <clears throat> listened or read much of these stories, especially getting you know, closer to the end of the game. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, he said a lot of important stuff just there. Did he? <laughs> that yeah. really helps you in the next area. I was like, oh! This is how you're supposed to figure out these puzzles. <laughs> Glad we have you. Um, so, no, stay here. The <laughs> druids just, like, disappear. They're gone. They're <laughs> gone <laughs> from this whole island. Um, but we're going to go look at our spell book again. And we're going to look at the third spell. And you're going to cast, uh, make it and cast it here. I believe cast it as well. Third spell. Wow. Skull full of hot oak embers. Oh, we could do that. A bit of sulfur Ooh. brimstone. <laughs> and a strand of a pure hearted maiden's hair. Add hair and brimstone to skull for of embers. In presence of creature, speak incantation over skull. Chill so we'll until... get the skull ready, but we won't cast it until we're um, at, until we've found the creature of the night. Chill until solid. So it's salt <laughs> for the egg? Yeah. Alexander oh, I, I actually didn't pick up, up on that. Red hot embers <laughs> in the ancient human skull. I mean, technically, I mean, it, it technically wouldn't be it, but... I know. <laughs> rotten egg smell, so... Well, like when you I overcook a, when you overcook an egg, it's a little sulfury. Alexander well, it's because smelly. it smells like it. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. So get uh, the other two things into the skull, and then we could go find the creature. So the egg. Alexander puts the strand of hair into the skull. So the other way, real quick. Um, the other way would have been. You would have gotten the strand of hair from the dress. Um, you didn't have to talk to Kasima at all, so that all is optional. Okay. You never have to use the mocking jaybird. But so if you didn't and you never got the ribbon, um, then you would get the strand of hair from the lady's dress. Okay. Ah. And so if you didn't, if you didn't and look in the dress, the... and you didn't talk to Kasima, and then you got to this part and you put out the fire, you'd be screwed. Um, yes, but if you got to that part where you did put out, because the other way to go into the castle is to use the dress to sneak in as a maid. So oh. we're at the point of no return where we can't go to the short path of the castle because we've lost the dress. Okay. Mm. Well, Alexander cracks the spoiled egg and dumps it into the skull containing the embers and the strand of hair. Now you need to find, it said it, it, it eats a noxious bush. 
zones of um, steam. A poison bush, I guess you could say. Yeah. Um, do you know where you might find that? The flower. Stinky that flower. Was not true. Just, do you remember where you even got that? The. Not here. No. No. Alexander. Where did we get that? Every time. Um. What? It was a pickup that I had you get before you went to the Isle of Wonder to do the scent challenge. For senses. Was it at the mountain? Mm-hmm. Alexander yeah. feels a strain. Because there was that flower all the way at the bottom, and we also got yeah. that black feather. Oh, there's something else? No. Mm, no, you need to go up. Oh, again? Last time. No puzzles this time, I guess. No, yeah, that's true. Do, 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 oh, yeah, you gotta get that tree. That these jerks stole do, do, for do, whatever do, do, do. reason. Do, do. Yeah, um, and I guess in that way we've... Apparently, the guide said confirmed that all the islands have had something... There oh, is something thank goodness. Precious. Yeah, stolen from them. Alexander um, arrives at the top don't of the get any closer to it or save and get yeah. closer I don't know if you die you might it might kill you I would assume it will I hope it does that'd be good <laughs> hey it's there the nightmare footsteps startles the black horse <laughs> she flies oh. off leaving Alexander alone at the top of the cliffs game over <laughs> Um, <laughs> I guess maybe you could go out and back in or you could just restore I'm just going to restore <laughs> okay so we... uh, yeah now you can cast your spell oh we cast it okay I was going to say throw the, the dagger at it <laughs> no so now I try to kill it yo no <laughs> Horace is like, oh, what are you reading? Speaks the incantation over the skull. Creature of night, to me succumb. Fire and brimstone leave thee numb. Purity bind thee like a chain. To do whate'er I now ordain. Oh no, it's wafting. You are the last member Nightmare of the her DK at the crew. Scent of the fire and brimstone. <laughs> That's it. Come on. I need passage to your homeland, fiery one. Well, if you're a corn. Unable to resist the power of the enchanted smell, Nightmare approaches Alexander. Her eyes appear <laughs> glassy and Take this sightless. magic! In her hypnotized state, she is unaware of the human so close to her flank, <laughs> or of anything at all except that marvelous smell. Graham would just throw a pie Me at it and then it would be tamed. <laughs> Says uh -huh. <laughs> oh, thanks for the pie. <laughs> no, instead, Alexander makes like horse catnip. Uh, say, Why was that first person get here, to you? I don't know. <laughs> um, because if you touch any ghost, you die. Mm. And some of the inhabitants don't look too friendly. Ah! <laughs> That being said, we talk to these front ghosts. Any oh. of those ghouls, you die. The ghosts, we want to talk to, actually. I don't know how you're supposed to know this. I, well, I clicked. Who are there you, we go. Spirits? <laughs> I am Queen Ilaria of the land of the Green Isles. And this beloved spirit is my husband. King hey, what's poppin'? We were murdered in our beds by our trusted wizier. Like a viper. He snuck in during the night and stabbed us in our sleep. Now my husband's soul is broken, and he will not speak. Then you are the ones I seek. Are you not the parents of Princess Cosima? Our daughter. Have you news of the princess? I know that she is alive and safely back in her kingdom after being rescued from Mordak. But I'm afraid I've not dad. seen her. Alhazred is keeping her in her room and mourning for you. 
I am glad to hear of her return, but she will not be safe alone with that devil. Oh, that we could be there to protect her. Kasima, how I fail thee. My poor husband will never rest while our murder goes unavenged and our daughter is in danger. I came to take you back with me. Your people are still loyal to you. They need to know about the Wazir. Kasima needs you too. But this is the realm of <laughs> the The Wazir. We cannot leave it. Nor for that matter can you. The only one who might be able to return us all to the land of the living is the Lord of the Dead. But he would never help us. He has no mercy. I might be able to convince him. I must try. Then take this. It is my ticket to the underworld. There you will find the Lord of the Dead. I cannot use the ticket as long as I'm chained here. And if we cannot be avenged, I will never be unchained. Thank you. Perhaps it will save us all. Be careful, young man. If you can ease my husband's torment and help our daughter, we will be most grateful. I will do my best. Goodbye, Queen Alaria. Great. Let's get out of here. Um, that's another spirit we want to talk to. Why do you not rest, sad spirit? Rest? I cannot rest. My son is lost. Lost? You mean in this realm? No. His spirit is stuck in the land of the living, probably looking for me. But I cannot leave to go show him the way. Poor Ali. Is there anything I can do? Take this handkerchief. If you get back to the land of the living and find him, tell him that his mother is waiting for him here. By this kiss, he'll be able to find his way to the realm of the dead. I'll do my best to find him. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, my Ali. Oh. Mm. Um, uh, Tarks asks you, Ryan, did I, did you, uh, play any other uh -oh. I can't I move, I cannot move. Um, <laughs> I think you're fine, it's just if you actually, like, click on them. Yeah. Like, uh, okay. <laughs> like you can't move, I'm like, Joe, it's coming up behind you. <laughs> um, I played all the King's Quests when I was a kid. <clears throat> I started out with five, um, and then we played six, and then after that, my parents were like, oh, you guys like these games. I'm safe here. The skeleton to the left of the path. Because no, you didn't die. To the but that approach the underworld entrance. The song. You're at the death screen, <laughs> and you cannot die here. You cannot die on the death screen to get to the death Take screen. It, please. But you oh. do need to do something <laughs> incredibly important here. Play that music. Alexander picks up the um, bones on the ground. And then, oh, sorry, Tarks. No, then my parents were like, oh, you guys like these games. So um, they bought all the rest of them in like a pack it, because they were all just like DOS games. So it was not that much. And we played all, all of them. I played all seven. The musical call of the bones. They begin to jiggle, then to dance. Hell yeah. I'm doing what that, that one over there is doing. <laughs> now I'm doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why he's got a bum foot. That's how he died. Yeah. I like his mohawk though. Yeah. Yeah, he's awesome. What was it? What, what do they keep doing whenever we died? It was tickets, please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, since we have the, uh, whatchamacallit on now, the what they say um i believe he says next but it's always cut off yeah it's like <laughs> take it please yeah. <laughs> <laughs> who knew alexander, hey, alexander was so good at the xylophone resume their posts despite their frolic they don't seem any friendlier 
That's okay. They got a job to do. Hey, when the music Beyonce moves you, you, you move so with it. Mm-hmm. Beyonce told me that. Uh, where do we go? Yeah. Uh, you cannot complete the game without that key. So now, but uh, now that we got that, we give the ticket to enter the deck. Alexander deck-world. sees no World. way to use that. What? I have a ticket. Oh, to that guy. Oh, uh, <laughs> I was like, wait, what? Next. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Thank you. Um, and now we want to. Does it? I guess. Do you touch that guy? We want to do something to um, this dude. Ah, hug him. Apparently, huh? Alexander's not the only one who's curious about the body on the path. The ribbon hug is it. so old, it would crumble at Alexander's touch. I will hug it. What? Really? Alexander has no need for the old armor. He decides to leave the knight's remains as undisturbed as possible. Okay. That's very nice of you. Alexander takes the knight's <laughs> Except for the gauntlet. Yeah, except for that. <laughs> Flesh may cross the portal and seek its master death. You learn the Earth God's flesh theory. Flesh may go where death is trod <laughs> and challenge, like Scheherazade, he who reigns beneath the sod to spare a mortal's breath. Zounds, that sounds serious. Woo. Well, I guess I'll get on, right? No. <laughs> oh my god, if you got on. <laughs> um, you need something here. Um, look in your spell book. It's the river Styx, Joe. I mean. Okay. We're already... The realm of the dead is a very dangerous place. We're already dead. The realm, dead. Of the realm of the realm. Really? The realm the re wow. The realm that's the rude. Realm the realm of. Well, um, realm. one of your spells requires, um. Yeah, let's see if you could do it here. The realm, Doubt it, but the realm, no. The wow. Realm. Um, one of your spells requires water of the river sticks. Oh, okay. So let's go grab some of that water. It actually needs to go in the teacup. Um, and you're closest to it by the shore in the next screen. Alexander doesn't want to... Al Al Hmm. Alexander, you're fine. Use the What's gonna happen? Right? You think Using those ghosts are gonna sneak up on you? Like, come on. No, thanks. Alexander yep. Oh, I thought that <laughs> ghost put his hand on your shoulder. He's leading me to onto the boat. Not to get any yeah, he's... That's Charon, you know, the guy that ferries the people across the river sticks. Oh, yeah, no, but the way his hand lifted up, it looked like it was... Like, he just lightly put it on your shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> it did. Um, but now we're going to go with Charon to across the river. Oh. Because there's really no way back from where we're here. I mean, I guess how else are we going to get out besides going forward? Mm -hmm. uh, it's a probably good time. Uh, you just saved, though, right? Oh, I mean, just... it's always good to save in the land of the dead. It's uh, very dangerous. And, like, every screen's important. <laughs> um, but how are you going to get on here? Uh, I think you broke the game. It you broke seems the like game. it. Just kind of sitting there. Oh no! You gotta get the water again, don't you? No, I, I did it right before. Oh, okay. Are you sure? Pretty positive. Oh. But... Alexander, the teacup already can. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, why is it doing that again? Hmm. Okay, I guess Leave. don't move in there. <laughs> you just need to give him something. Okay. <laughs> he doesn't want to talk oh, to me. Oh, no. All right. Um,. Any yeah, mythology? Then. What do you give him? What was that? To cross. Do you know it's a 
ancient customs. People lay coins on the dead's eyes to give mm-hmm. them ah. to Charon. That's why people lay coins well, on dead people's coins eyes. Do is fair for passage. Charon accepts the fare and waves Alexander. I thought they the were still mints. Yeah, sure, whatever. I forgot they were coins. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, what? Oh. I don't know why this screen was so glitchy for you, though. That's yeah. crazy. Did not want to play whatever scene was supposed to happen. Mm-mm. That was a nice ride. Thank um, you. Yeah, I mean, he dropped you off right at the gates of the Lord of the Dead, so that's very kind of him. Alexander reaches out to open the gate. Suddenly, the, the wood gate reaches back. his fingertips. Yeah, how's it going? <laughs> the dark <laughs> has awakened my sleep. <gasps> Megabyte. Megabyte. <laughs> it was also the the druid in the. It was also the Kali. Mm-hmm. Yep. The human that I might devour it. It has been centuries since I last ate. Hungry boy. How about a mint? Oh, I don't have any mint. Shit. Um, this one's not very clear. You, you just have to talk to him again. Okay. Despite his fear, Alexander summons his bravest voice to command the living gate. I would pass, gate. I have business with your master. My master and thine, human. I would be pleased. Silence, Enzo. Only step <laughs> forward and thou shall meet him shortly. No, thank you. I come to meet the Lord of the Dead with my flesh still intact. And why should I let you pass, human, when I would much rather eat you? I have been told that there is a way for humans to enter Death's realm. There must be something I can do. Some there must be that will allow me something. to pass through your doors, Gate. Hmm. I seem to recall something, a trick, uh, perhaps um, a test. Mm. Ah, yes. Should a human try to pass, a riddle is Gates won't to ask. <clears throat> a riddle it is, then. And if thou wouldst fail to answer Gate, his thirsty jaws, Will be thy fate. Agreed. Listen okay. As the Agreed. I like then, human, <laughs> for it surely does. My first is foremost legally. My second circles outwardly. My third leads all in victory. My fourth twice ends a nominee. My whole. Is this gate's only key? My first donut hole. Most legally, my second circles outwardly. My third leads all in victory. My fourth twice ends a nominee. My whole is this gate's only key. See you, biscuit. <laughs> uh, if you get this wrong, he will eat you. Yeah, I did, I did say it before. Can't put ass. <laughs> you can't put ass, Joe. <sighs> you also cannot unclick. So oh shit! Don't mistype. <laughs> the only way you can click on is N. <laughs> Don't sound so disappointed. I will make it quick. Perhaps. Slurp him up like a noodle. He does. <laughs> <laughs> I'm back. Sorry, guys. What? How did this? <laughs> Only. Next. Is oh, I actually said it this time. Tickets. Oh. What to do? Somewhere <laughs> sticky. There's a clue.
<laughs> restart. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you just God. have to restart the game, which you might in King's Quest. Like, like I said, there are two items in here that if we didn't get, like you can't once you leave the place, like you can't come to the back to the land of the dead either. You know, when you leave, so uh -huh. it's like mm -hmm. all the other places you could come back to. What I H R Geiger. You might have to restart at some places. Places? Places? Lurp it down. <laughs> Despite his uh, 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 and what? what? Have... Mm. Okay, so um, he he. Uh, I think you guys could figure this one out. Um, the riddle. The first is he's talking about the first letter. The second is the second letter. Third is third letter, and fourth and the fourth letter. My third mm -hmm. leads. My first is lead. foremost legally. My second circles outwardly. My third leads all in victory. Uh, go up to the and top. My fourth twice ends a nominee. Oh, you can't. My whole is this gate's own. I. Whoops. Ah. Whoops. Ciao. If you click off it, then that yeah. means. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Decide. No. And why? No. 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 <laughs> and if agreed, this my foot. My first Wait, this has to do with the riddle book you got? My second circles Tarks? outwardly. My third yeah, uh, remember that riddle book that we did have? My fourth twice ends. Oh, the PDF. Anyway. My whole is this gate's. No, 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 no. We had a riddle book that we changed for the the um. We had a riddle book. We exchanged it for the magic book, the spell book. Oh, um, okay. In the riddle book, we looked at it. And it read off some riddles, but it also had the same border as another piece of paper that we had that we got from a spider. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, yeah. This was one of the riddles in it. We read, like, three. <clears throat> but it also happened to be the riddle that didn't end because a piece of it was torn out. Do you okay. remember the word that was on the page? That the Love. That is true. Um, so now how you see my first and is foremost legally could be an L. My second circles outwardly being an O. My mm -hmm. third leads to victory being a V. And my fourth uh, twice ends a nominee being E. The answer is love. Why do you have to say it like that? <laughs> love. Didst thou guess love? That riddle should never have been solved. Love is unknown in this realm. I read it love in a book. Be banished? Yeah. Even from this place, there are. I do remember that being on the page. Yeah. When you picked it up. Still less I mean, that would be really. You could still figure it out without it, but it'd be really hard to remember that poem from the riddle or that riddle from the riddle book. Yeah. From that long ago. You can go ahead and save again. I can't. Oh, too bad. Oh, okay, you can. <laughs> That's like the guards for. Uh... Excuse me. I'd like an audience. Please. Silent Hill. I was gonna say from uh, Alexander to the Harvester. Star Wars. The dead. Oh, oh. Those, those red mm. ones. Why have you entered my domain? This is still bad. wearing your flesh. If you are so. Oh, he's got fleshless dead, knees. You might have yeah. found oh, it no. easily enough. I mean, you can't the chase land us. Of the living. No. But since you are here. You are most welcome to stay. Kiss my hand, and you will be one with the spirits. There will be no pain. Death feels a strange pulling sensation. <laughs> <laughs> um, you do not want to kiss his hand. I mean, you can and you'll die. But you'll want to do something else. Give him the rabbit's <laughs> It is an item you give him. Stinky. Alexander is carrying the mother. No, Alexander not that. Alexander is carrying the mother ghost. Oh yeah, we need that for. Beast's mirror consists Give him the mint. We don't have. Oh, the. The peppermint leaves are the color of dark emeralds. 
Here, sir, have this mint leaf. Alexander is carrying an... The little bottle contains some sort of potion and bears a label saying... What if it's the bottle? So, he's telling you to kiss... Um, I'll give you a hint. He's telling you to kiss his hand. You don't want to, so what's a way to show that you challenge someone? Whoa. Slap him with the glove. The iron gauntlet is a bit too small. You're kidding me. I did not come here to die, but to demand my right of challenge. <laughs> I respect <laughs> This tiny little glove <laughs> hitting this huge I'm man. Down this Just gauntlet. a light slap. Man may pass the portal and seek its master, death. Man may pass where death has trod and challenge like Scheherazade. Like Schwarzenegger. He who reigns beneath the sod <laughs> to spare a mortal's breath. He has the gauntlet! Impossible! He challenges death. <laughs> who are you to challenge death? A man of flesh is Shut up, door. Be, my lord. <laughs> and what is it that you seek with this challenge? The soul of some dead maiden? I seek the souls of King Caliphim and Queen Alaria, the land of the Green Isles. You would save two human souls and emerge alive from this realm yourself? That shall be a difficult challenge, indeed. The tomb does not open its doors lightly. Either all three of us leave, or none go. Very oh. well. Then let me think of an appropriate task. A ah, riddle. <laughs> yes. Our and wrestling. now, your challenge is this. For thousands of years, I have sat upon this throne. I have heard every sad tale that can be told by human lips. I have seen tragedies that ended empires, injustices that defy reason, love that would like the very stars turn cold and hard. I have seen torments that cannot possibly be born, and yet must be okay. for centuries. I have That's listened nice. to this every I have My Chemical done. Romance song. <laughs> I have never shed a tear. Make me cry, thou men of flesh. That Tickle his feet. is my challenge. Uh. <laughs> Make death cry? Make Sooner death Sooner could he cry? turn sea to stone. Or fire to ice. Well, that's actually not too hard. We've got a feather. Tickle him. I mean, you might want to say it first. Yeah, you might want to say it first. <laughs> just Tark Don't just erroneously. <laughs> Tark says, uh, look how small Alexander's arms compared to Graham's. It's true. I mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's true. Like, uh, wow. That's why he wears the baggy clothes. Is a bit of a stretch. Oh, come on. Well, well, I mean, at least there's an answer for Screw that. Screw you, game. <laughs> Let's see. Shove the mint in his eye. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Give him the white, beautiful rose. It's so beautiful, he won't cry. It's so beautiful. This, cry. That does not provoke my tears, mortal. <laughs> Okay. Oh, he doesn't kill you. Oh, wow. Give him the Your stinky flower. has been all that you say it has. Then truth alone shall be my sword. The mirror's surface swirls with... My head. Are you kidding me? It's the huge. <laughs> images even blacker. <laughs> Reflections of it's just a It's just a little tablet that plays uh, the Johnny Cash Hurt video. Colder, <laughs> more immutable than any forged by man. I world of thirsts never be feels the mirror tremble in his grasp and is glad that he cannot see its face. But the Lord of the Dead is transfixed to the mirror, to the screening of his life. Things long forgotten are once more uncovered. That wasn't a guess, I actually had a reason behind that. Throne while still a man. <laughs> oh no, it makes sense. I just I wanted more fun stuff. Growing ever more numb to it. 
I would have tickled death. A new thing altogether, which became that which he is now. His is an existence that has no possibility of redemption, no end. The surrounding spirits draw away in pain. The truth is so sharp it stabs, so intense it sears. <gasps> Aye. Take it away. Make it stop. Take it away. Oh my god. Way to be dramatic, people. One solitary tear. From the strain, and death sheds a single, <laughs> gray, single tear. gray tear. Truth is indeed a terrible thing. I have worn this mantle for so long, I had forgotten its dreadful weight. You shall take the souls and leave as I agreed. You have been granted to stay from this inevitable reality. I almost envy you. Find the souls he has claimed <laughs> and bring them to me. King Calafim and Queen Alaria, I presume. Your hero has won you a few I didn't sound like he did finger quotes for that. <laughs> May your souls be more prepared for King their rest. <laughs> ah! <laughs> and you How about the stab flesh. wound? I uh, can't My do anything about that, shall sorry. Take the three of you back to the land of the living. Tell her where it is you wish to go. <laughs> Until we meet again, I assure you, we will meet again. No offense, my lord, but I hope that much we like taxes, you'll see me now. soon. It is never <laughs> as long as you might wish, mortal. Now, be gone. Yes, my lord. <laughs> Get the hell out of here! <laughs> ah, yes. Stunning scenery. If only we could see it. <laughs> if only we could see it. <laughs> Just the back of coming, the Majesty? fucking horns. treachery must be handled carefully, Alexander. Alari and I must go gather our allies and form a... So plan. you do it alone. <laughs> yeah. Sure Maybe the clown will help you. I don't we know. As soon as we can to take back all that has been stolen from us. I will keep her safe until your return. Thank you, son. Your love for our daughter must be deep indeed for you to... It's a little weird, but I mean, all right. For our sakes. We'll indeed. take what we can get. <laughs> May we succeed in what awaits us and live long together as a family. You're not dead anymore, though. Oh. <laughs> okay. But you <laughs> saved over it now. Oh, well. Done. You are not. Note. <laughs> Note dead anymore. <laughs> have to live um, so you could give uh, you could give the pelican or no, the bird. Give the bird something. I was gonna say, give the bird, <laughs> give the bird the stinky egg. You could give the bird something. You already used a stinky egg. Yeah. Oh, is no it more. gone? Gone? Mm -hmm. Aww. Mm -hmm. The oh, ribbon. The rose. It's her ribbon she gave you. You can. Yeah, but you can be like, "Hey, I'm back." Alexander holds up. This is how you say, "Hey, I'm back." I guess. Hey, babe. Anybody can give the white rose. <laughs> So everything that you've done since you've been to the land of the dead has all been extra. So, like, you could have beaten the game without getting her parents back. Okay, wow. Oh, a, a rose, huh? A white rose. How beautiful. It must be from Alexander. How I wish that I could see him with my own Rock, eyes. It's from Ali, actually. Rock. Never allow it. <laughs> he only risks capture by sending me these things. Dear to my heart though they are. Fly elsewhere, my pretty friend. Do not <laughs> what a <injure> fool. <laughs> Prince Alexander again by taking tokens from his hand. Forgive me, Alexander, and forget me. 
I cannot return your love for fear that I shall never leave this castle again. Oh, wow. She left him on red. For the game, you didn't have to do Alexander anything with Sing Sing. All of that is completely like optional. Oh, well. But the bird does I like I made the Could left him on red joke wrong? before. Or does Cosima simply not welcome his attentions further? Oh, well. Better persist. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, you saved his parents. Her parents. That doesn't uh, mean she's into him. Yeah. yeah. Um, there are things we need to do in the pawn shop and with that guy. Yeah, you could give him a lamp. Excuse me, peddler. But I have an old lamp that might interest you. <gasps> ah, an old lamp. And what a nice traditional design, too. <laughs> Take a pick of my new lamps. Do you remember a scene a long time ago where the vizier, where the genie got drunk off his mint and came to the vizier's desk and went into his bottle on his desk? Do you recall that scene at all? I Vaguely. recall the scene. I don't remember what the lamp looked like. Looks yeah. Like... Well, you have to. Because <laughs> it looks like one of these. <laughs> this one? The blue one? Yeah, actually. Okay. Oh, wow. It was either this one I or the one next to it. I was thinking the red on the end. It is, it is that blue one that you're on. Fine choice, my son. Here is your new life. Man, they... Ren, they drew his Thank teeth yep. individually really well. Yeah, he, he okay. didn't have a portrait in the old one. <laughs> one of the new. Oh they gave. Portrait they either. put extra effort into that man. Dread, another dud. No. <laughs> no. Pawn shop. Good day, Prince Alexander. We are actually gonna trade in. <laughs> Alright, do whatever, whatever you want to do. <laughs> yeah! Alexander may not at all care for that man in black, but that's no excuse for getting violent. Fine. Boo! The pawn shop owner doesn't look like a man to be tussled with. The curiosities business is just dangerous enough to require. I just want to go. The pawn shop. Oh, I gotta talk to him. Right. How fair you, good merchant? I could use more business. <laughs> I was thinking. Alexander walks into the uh, into here with like the Seinfeld theme in the background, <laughs> like <laughs> like what's his face, Kramer. Just um, bust him in. Take the drink me potion here. Alexander suddenly gets a very sneaky idea. Oh, I can't no. go on anymore. Without Cosima, I'd just rather not live. Prince Alex, no. Prince Alex, no. <laughs> my best customer. I give up. Poison is my last resort. Stop. I am... What? No. <laughs> More. Young fool. He's dead. He's dead. Wait until Abdul hears. He'll be so pleased. <laughs> Get some more Altoids, by the way. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, look at that. To not yeah. like everybody You're else. supposed to. Well, I am. You, you could have come here first, but you really wanted to trade the lamp with the guy, so I wasn't gonna stop you. <laughs> well, what is it? Prince Alexander is dead. He killed himself in despair over losing Cosima. <laughs> what? Are you that super owns. That young man has proven to be most devious. I saw the whole thing myself, Master. He was really and truly quite dead. Hmm. If what you say is true, it shall be most convenient. 
You've spent enough time on that little irritant. We must start thinking about the wedding. Anything, Master? Oh, I do love weddings. Well, we do want you to look your prettiest, don't we? Now, shum hmm? shamizel. Good luck with you. <laughs> Gleam in his eye. As we discuss. <laughs> Wink. <laughs> yeah. Alexander's heart lurches to life in his chest. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Alex, but you, you were... Yeah, because someone, Sorry, I forgot who it was, but someone else suggested, like, hey, you should, you know, pretend like you're dead to them. Mm -hmm. and who, I, I don't know who said that, someone earlier. Yeah. So it was all like a ruse to be like, yeah. hey, look. Uh, you have a thing from your mom or something. Here. Uh, the Tinder box, and Ali is the guy with the books. Oh, shoot. Uh, the Tinder box. Here you go. Would you mind if I traded this in? Of course, Prince Alex. Please, choose something. Alexander. Uh, Last one we need. Paint. Brush, yes. I think I'd like the painter's brush. Very good, Prince Alex. The painter's brush it is. May your painting go well. Feel free to bring back the brush at any time. Thank you. I feel like it's funny, because, like, the vizier, when he was talking, like, tried not to sound like a vampire. But at the same <laughs> time, he had to have a slight accent. He and... tried. Now, nothing. Nothing, sorry. What can I do for you? Run. You seem like you have an issue. Here's the tissue. <laughs> Alexander might have a hard time trying to explain that ghost handkerchief. Yeah, it doesn't go to him. Oh. Is there something I need to do here? No, actually, uh, we could go to the oh. castle. Later, dude. Yeah, bye. <laughs> I will save at the crossroad here. That's a normal, normal walk there. I'm just gonna walk we are right in. Under orders not to let you anywhere near the castle, Prince Alexander. Be gone. Well, how about so go off to the side of the castle now, and you'll want to cast um, one of your last spell. Uh, let's see. It's first one. Ah, okay. Swamp ooze, river sticks, water, black horse feather. Add sticks water to swamp ooze in cup. Stir with horse feather. Apply blank surface to blank surface with artist brush. Speak incantation over painting to materialize. What are we materializing? Oh, you know. We're making a hole. Oh. Is my guess. Uh, Swamp Ooze. Plus... Feather? Am I missing something Yeah, else? I think everything oh. else is in there. Because the River Styx is already in there, so yeah. Yep. So just the Feather. For half a second I was like, wait, did we put the... Alexander River Styx the water in the, the in the lamp the that we gave away? <laughs> and stirs the contents gently. I don't know that we could, but... To his amazement, the jet black color of the feather slowly drains from end to tip into the teacup. The teacup mixture blackens and thickens to a paint-like consistency. Alexander carefully puts it away, discarding the drained feather. Okay. Uh, now you could cast it. Oh yeah, we need to cast it.
speaking the incantation would do little good unless there were a painted object oh. nearby to enchant. Okay, now you paint, I guess. To, to paint something, uh. Alexander must first choose a location where he wants. Feeling yep. artistically inspired, Alexander decides to make use of the large blank castle wall. Ah, a doorway. Just what Alexander was thinking this wall needed. Okay, now we do it. Hmm. Nope. There's no point in using a... Alexander opens the spell book. That dog is crying again. What, by you? Yeah. Hmm. With trepidation, Alexander gathers his strength for the enchantment of the painted door. Magic paint, black as ink. Bring to life what I think. Make it real what I draw, according to this spoken law. The spell worked. <gasps> the door has magically solidified. Oh, like an actual door? Oh, come on. What? <laughs> to be inside. <laughs> That's just silly. What did you want? You made a door. I wanted... I don't know. You wanted a hole. I wanted a hole. Um, let's say now. The magic paint door fades back into the wall. So much for an easy exit. We're welcome to the castle where ram randomly generated events happen. Woohoo! Um, so pause or something. Because time is consistent with, uh, yeah. Um, the game generates a random guard uh, encounters in the basement. You should be able to avoid them by following the walker. The uh, first time you'll get caught, Jala will let you out. The second time you get caught, you can use something. And then, but the third time you get caught, it's game over. Um, we do need to get caught, I think, at least. Um, but with that being said, uh, Use your hand icon on the middle door on the right. Middle door on the right. Yeah. Alexander opens the dungeon door and slips inside. Mother? Mother, where are you? Tell your children not to come my way. <laughs> What's the matter, <laughs> little boy? I'm lost. I can't find my mother. Is it I don't know why she would just Martin? Here. I've been alone ever so long. Maybe. Mother? Mother, where are you? That's Martin. There you go. You must be the son of the spirit I met in the realm of the dead. She gave me this handkerchief and asked me to tell you that she's waiting for you there. It's Mama's. It even smells like her. That bad spider sprite actually now. made me feel things. <laughs> Wait, before you go, is there anything you can tell me it's about not a bad sprite. I like to but... play in secret. No, but it's it's yeah. not. It's not very realistic, yeah. I guess. Is... <laughs> but yeah, it, but those those four pixels. It, it was yep. Yeah, didn't like it. Yep, yeah, those pixel legs. Oh, now it's oh, in the room with me. Shit. Farewell. <laughs> uh, you can leave. Or, um, <laughs> go... <laughs> Just busts out. I'll say it again. So to the, um... Bottom right across. This one? No, like, leave this area. Oh. Um, hallway. And go in that door on the right side. Alexander decides to find out what's on the other yes, yes, side yes. Walk, of walk, that walk. door. <laughs> From it's hither. Alexander. I can't believe it. How did you get into the castle? Oh. Well, I... Actually, it's a little hard to explain. I bet. <laughs> you run the terrible risk of being here, though. The castle is crawling with guard dogs, especially today. 
The Wazir will have your hide if he finds you. I know that, Jalo. But Kasima is being married today. What greater risk is there than that? Of course you're right. Young love. <laughs> I forgot what heartburn it is. But what are you supposed to do about it? I've got to try to see her. Maybe even stop the wedding. Is that all? And here I thought you would try something dangerous. <sighs> Don't worry about me, friend. Just tell me, where is Kasima? As far as he's I know, so she's mad in his says. quest to save her that there, he's though. just going to murder her. Yep. Everywhere. And they're very <laughs> oh no. <to> the crown. <laughs> Took a dark right turn. Now, yeah. The crown means El Hazred. If we had proof of something truly a foul, the guard dogs might listen. As it is, they're your enemies, not his. I understand. I've had no lack of enemies since I got here. In fact, you'd almost think I wasn't welcome. In fact, I don't like the cut of your <laughs> jib, Jallo. Have no sense of humor. <laughs> Have at you. Well, I can see there's no putting you off. For Kasima's sake, I wish you luck. I'll be here if there's anything you need. Thanks, Jallo. There is actually something you can give him. Mm. The lucky rabbit's foot. Uh, oh, wait, no. no. Yeah. <laughs> I've been thinking of what you said about swapping a replica the for the mother's Jimmy handkerchief. I got this lamp from Again. the lamp seller in town. Do you think it will pass? <laughs> he also goes to the land of the dead. <laughs> Off I go. Yes, it's an exact replica. That's amazing. How did you guess? I suppose it was intuition. <laughs> I'll have to wait for the right moment, mind you. <laughs> but I, I get you. Oh, young intuition. Wise, now you shall see Jello's <laughs> skill. I'm sure your hands are mightier than my sword, my clever friend. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and do as you've planned, and let me worry about swapping the lamp. I can prove you wrong. The trickery. <laughs> oh no! Managed to get the lamp to you somehow. You never fear. I have faith, Jolo. You are a true friend. Oh shucks! I'd do anything for the princess. To be oh, clear, shucks. this isn't for you. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so the ghost boy told you that at the north area of the basement is a suit of armor that is a secret passage. Um, so you could, uh, if you use the gauntlet, or you said something along those lines. Oh, uh, God, Jello. Come on, Jello. Dumb the dumb the dumb. <laughs> <laughs> He's literally going up the stairs at the same speed. You'll get there eventually. One step at a time. Oh, we gotta wait for that? Like, <laughs> yeah, come on. Yeah. Seriously? dum de dum de dum <laughs> So, do, you, uh, do not touch the door, but touch the... And a guard's footsteps armor. heavily down a flight of stairs. Okay. Well, but touch the armor If I'm quick... <laughs> Alexander examines the suit of armor. You need to touch the hand. Special. Remembering what the little boy ghost said... Alexander experiments with the suit Boy of armor. Ghost. He pushes down, then pulls up what a Casper's right, right arm. A secret passage. Ooh. Stolen treasure map. Nice little <laughs> wrap around he did there. Yeah. <laughs> the sound of voices coming from nearby. That was one nope. of the scarier parts about um in uh, yep. Evil Within was the loading screens because they had like people like laughing, but it sounded mm -hmm. like it was in another room. Yeah. It was uh, a. Yeah, Evil Within had some real good set pieces. Oh, like, they had a lot of good. Like, they had a ton of good ideas that made it like creepy, but yeah. then. I've been hearing rumors from the guards. <sighs> then. It, it's okay. So, it's I a, like it's it. a good game. Yeah. I still want to go through and play it again one time. A solid Not seven easy. and a half. Dogs. Ain't no oh yeah, for sure. Who would willingly keep the princess anywhere she don't want to be? I just I remember claims that a foreign me kicking down the enemies because mm -hmm. I had no ammo. He kept under lock and key right up until the wedding. Call me an old dog that can't learn new tricks, but I say the princess should be the one given the orders. Al Hazred has been in charge for months. What with the king's death and Kasima's mourning. 
Tonight, the wedding will seal it. And there's nothing we can do about it. Like him or not, he's our lead. Need <gasps> I remind you of your oath to the crown? Aye, we were no. Stolen know. treasure map. For the sake of the princess, <laughs> we'll not be forgetting it. He'd just better treat her well. Speaking of the wazir, what do you reckon he's keeping in that magical room of his? It's not a magic Born. room. It's just the door he's <clears throat> enchanted somehow. I say he's still got the royal treasury in there, along with whatever else he's so eager to protect. Not even the court treasurer is allowed in there anymore. I heard him in the hall the other day. He was speaking to that door. Black man. Oh, that's the guy that's saying. I heard him say. Would you like to? But then Bay came. Watch the intro or whatever. Or have you played King's mm -hmm. Quest before? Enough. It is not our place to question the practices of our liege, no matter how strange. The wedding will be starting soon. Report to the throne room when you hear the music start. Okay, okay. What? That last part, I guess, wasn't voiced, but okay. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Up we go. What is this goofy music? <laughs> it's sneaky music. Oops. Yep. Alexander peers through the chinks in the wall, trying to locate the source of the crying sounds. Alexander's palms begin to sweat and his heart to race. It's Cosima. He's found her. <gasps> Psst. Princess Cosima. What? Who's there? It is I. Alexander. Guards! I'm here behind the wall. <laughs> My, how suave that sounds. Alexander? What the fuck are you doing here? It really is you. Oh, I knew you were close by, but how did you get inside the castle walls? Kind of looks like her tummy's it's just sticking out. It does, yeah. yeah. A little bit. <laughs> you did get my ring. Oh, yes. It has brought me such comfort, Alexander, to know you were close by and had not forgotten. Wow, her but mouth is really here. big when yeah, she talks. Yeah, it's like <laughs> Ms. Pac-Man over there. I don't care about the danger. You do Not need to, be to fair, give his her something is when they stop talking for a bit and what just start it? staring at each other. You need to give her something important. Husband, okay. Do you want to wed him, Kasima? Oh, Kinda. Please believe me when I say that I never agreed to marry that man. Even when my father trusted Abdul absolutely, I never liked him. But with mother and father gone, I'm afraid there's no stopping him. If you do not Why? wish to marry him, Kasima, just say no. You yeah. shall not. I promise you. Only come with me now, and we shall escape. How? I cannot fit through this wall. Besides, do you think I could leave my kingdom, my people, in Abdul's hands? But Abdul would tear the castle apart if I were to disappear from my room. You shall have to do what you can to delay his plans from your end. I can't just leave you here. Alexander, do not despair. You can and you will! <laughs> I've been safe in this room for nearly six months now. Abdul can be in no hurry, whatever he plans. After all, I'm to be his bride, am I not? I have been planning two years. Ooh, soon. that makes me so mad! I believe if I can escape, if I can only get a chance to lay my hands on a weapon, there might be an opportunity in the hustle of the wedding. But I... Give her the dagger! Shh, just a moment more, then you must go. Give Let's her the rabbit's foot. Time with words. <laughs> Here, fit your, fit your lips through the crack you, best you can. Be, be, be. <laughs> He's a cyclops yeah, This now. is where okay. they just stare at each other, so... Dagger? Mm -hmm. Or the scythe. Or the oh, scythe. wouldn't it be awesome if she had the scythe? <laughs> yeah, you give her her <laughs> weapon of choice. <laughs> Take this dagger. It's not much. That'd be great. It might come in handy. Why, it's perfect. This is just the sort of thing I've been looking for. Thank you, Alexander. I'll keep it close and use There's a letter that she opens with it and gives it back to him. <laughs> That's exactly what I needed. I've got my eye on you. Uh, the dagger is one of the oh, things God. where you'll get to the Someone's final coming. scene, and if you never gave that to her, you'll die. Door <laughs> Alexander, hurry! 
Step away before they see you. She yells. Alexander hears scuffling and a woman's <laughs> brief cry from the other side of the wall. Then, silence. Oh, woo! <laughs> um. <laughs> you are not dead anymore. <laughs> <laughs> we never yeah. got caught down there. No, and that's fine. Okay. Uh, that it would have taken us to the room with the boy. You should be able to go that way. There we go. There we go. That brought me back to when we were playing that on the Wii. Uh oh. Alexander hears the sound of scratching coming from the other side of the wall. Meow. Meow. Well, spy in him. Cassandra? Through the chink in the wall. Or Kas I don't remember her name. Kasima. 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 Nice rhino, Dear dude. Shadrach, salutations from the Society of the Black Cloak, etc., etc. My long preparations are about to come to fruition. Do I have mm -hmm. to? In a matter of minutes, I will wed the lovely <laughs> Kasima. Once I've the rhino falls on him. Credits roll. A lot of holes in Nothing. these walls, is Kit. <laughs> yeah, right? Oh, no, they're everywhere. How convenient. One hole per room. Infuriatingly stubborn, as you know. Well, I guess really See, stuffy in those rooms. Quite he sounds like he's trying not to be a Dracula. Blue. <laughs> In a way, it is a shame I have to kill her. She is lovely and would be amusing to keep around, but I can't risk her talking treason to one of the guards. So far, I've managed to keep her. Boss, are you, are you reading while you're writing again? Forever. <laughs> well, on to it now. I'd send her to you, but as you know, I had no luck in doing so with Mordak. I close in triumph. King Abdul Al Hazred. Not there. king yet. I think it's about time to see if Shamir has taken care of the wench as I asked. It's almost time for the wedding. What is that profanity I hear from the wall? Oh well. <laughs> the wazir's words fill Alexander with blazing anger and fear for Kasima's life. Ooh, that blackguard! That murderous swine! He'll not have his way if I have anything to say about it. If only my dad were here, he'd bench press him. <laughs> There's a wall. Alexander sees nothing of it. What if I were to do this? Alexander doesn't see. <laughs> no. <laughs> There's kind of an outline on that last wall panel. You can oh, touch it. okay. Of course. <laughs> Alexander sees lots of black cloaks. So we need to do like two things here. Um, actually, kind of just one. The trunk is locked. Yep. Well, that's it. How are you gonna get in there? Yeah. Alexander inserts the skeleton key. In the oh, it's a skeleton. Okay. I was like, well, how does this work? Oh, of course, it's a skeleton key from the skeleton. Alexander <laughs> opens the trunk. Okay. Uh, the third bone's connected uh, to the books look interesting. third bone. The third bone's Alexander connected picks to the... up the most recent letter and examines oh, it. Oh, ah, the, the marriage bones. papers. The letter is addressed to Abdul uh. Al-Hazred from the wizard Shadrach. It reads, Greetings to a brother of the Black Cloak. I was sorry to hear of Great Mordak's death, though he was a bit of a ninny at chess. It seems the plans for that little kingdom of yours are coming along. I must congratulate you on your handling of the king and queen, isolating the island so that Imagine no if someone congratulated you after like stroke. owning somebody in like it some looks online like there's not much left to stand game of like Overwatch. Way. Do as I recommend. Well, he was kind of an girl. asshole playing you Overwatch. Have your crown. A Genji main, so. That fiend. <laughs> okay. Um, that box too. This box that That's your hand was just on. Yeah. Opens the ebony box and looks inside. 
Mm. The brush is old and small. Uh, just look at the piece of paper. Inside the ebony box is a piece of paper with the word Zebu printed on it. Mm-hmm. Some old ivory dice have been left Done. in the box. Um, so, uh, now this is, remember when I was like, we could end the game now? Yeah. Um, so everything now and after is what we would do when we enter the castle as a, uh, well, you would mock enter it as a maid because you'd wear the maiden's clothing mm -hmm. and then okay. you'd go in. Uh, so go back through the chest, uh, through the wardrobe and then retrace your steps all the way back down to the basement and leave the, the shortcut to reach the secret or passage. leave the secret passage. You would not do any of the secret passage stuff. Wow. Very different ends of the game then. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Yeah, you get a lot more story and stuff this way. Get down. There you go. That's where we go. <laughs> oh no, I'm stuck. Alexander oh, season. There we go. <laughs> All right. Um. So we'll go back to the left, and then we'll want to look at the door on the left side of the hall. Alexander doesn't see any way of opening that door manually. You will say something to the door. Since the door on the west wall has no visible knob or handle, Alexander decides to try to open it with his voice. He composes his words carefully. Zenu. Um, it's actually A L I Ali Zebu E Z E B U. Um, the guard dogs when we were spying on them. Oh. Um, they were saying something that Listen, the door. Guard, someone says Ali, you open. but can't Ali hear the Zabu. last one. It worked. Got it. So honestly, you probably wouldn't do this either because you wouldn't know about Ali or Zebu. Mm -hmm. But this one's kind of important. You get points for everything that you find here. It's all on the table. Alexander pulls the drapery aside, curious as to what might lie underneath. A body. <clears throat> um, use your eye and look at all four things on, on the, the table. table. Is a coat of arms with the head of a four? beast oh, on I guess the crest. Oops. On the table. So the oh, the, bad, the, the druid stole that. Things. Yeah. That fleece must belong to the winged ones, and they thought the Isle of Wonder had taken it. I mean, who saw this it's coming? A strange looking stone that's giving I saw this coming. high pitched noise. That must be the Isle of Wonders singing stone. Didn't the queens think that the beast had stolen it? On the table is a miniature oak tree. It looks very old. Hmm. That must be the sacred Aww, miniature oak yeah. that the druids thought the winged ones stole. As Alexander looks at the I hope they watered the it. Table, he realizes the depth of the wazir's cunning. It must have been the wazir or an accomplice who stole that one thing most precious to each island, and then leaked rumors that one of the other islands was responsible. What did the wazir have to gain by causing the islands to hate one another? To cause a power vacuum. Uh, is that it? Yeah. Uh, now you could actually go upstairs. Save first. Alexander hears the sound of music coming from the east. It sounds somewhat classical, but... Oh no. It's wedding music. Love that <laughs> capital O. Alexander hears a door off the North Hall open. Then, the sound of guard dog footsteps. The footsteps are headed this way. Okay. Here we go. Alexander hears the sound of a guard's footsteps coming from the north. Wait, there are more footsteps approaching from the west. Now what? 
I'm gonna go up? That's what. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's why it, they and had... it takes like and 10 minutes there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, maybe that's why they had you watch Jalo so you could see. Yeah. This is important. Remember this. <laughs> the wedding music is coming from behind those two large doors. Mrs. Bouvier! <laughs> <laughs> Prince Alexander, here. The wizier will have my head for allowing you within a mile of the royal wedding. Since you are of noble birth, I will give you five seconds to explain your presence here before killing you. I warn you, it had better be good. He oh, will shit. kill you. This? Yeah. Wait. If you love your princess, oh, I probably don't hear me out. Oh, well. The wizier is not what he appears to be. Kasima is in terrible danger. I have proof that this is so. For your princess's sake, you must believe me. Let me see that. Saladin reads the letter, his sword points still against Alexander's throat. Alexander watches the guard dog's noble face darken with rage. This is treason. I'll have his throat. But how do I know this letter is not a forgery? You could have written this yourself. But I did not. Have you no doubts of your own about a husband? Don't you see? All he wants is the crown. Kasima is being coerced. We must stop the wedding. It is true. I have had my suspicions about the Wizier, especially when King Caliphim and Queen Alaria died. But I have seen Kasima with him several times. She appears to be quite happy, even enthusiastic. I don't believe she could love him if he truly were so wicked. I cannot believe for a moment that she loves that snake. A jilted lover would not believe it. But come, see for yourself. The captain of the guard leads Alexander into the throne room. Wait, they didn't even give her like pretty clothes or anything. Alexander she just wear the same old blood. shit. They gotta, they, they gotta get the show on the road, Katie. <laughs> I guess. Kasima, declare Abdul Al Hazred as my lawful and beloved husband and king of this realm. But, Kasima. What are you saying? Do you still claim that the princess is being forced? Perhaps it's you that's the danger, as the wizier has said. It's news to me. Nope. Oh. Should I save first? Uh, always save. <laughs> this is important. <laughs> I'll kill uh, him! You could, just, well, you could just walk forward and it'll interrupt and start things. Paint his back! Alexander approaches the wedding party. <laughs> he drew a line down my butt! Prince Alexander here? <laughs> this is an outrage! How dare you allow this traitor to get past you, Saladin? You stupid mutt! Can't you even keep the castle free of assassins during your own princess's wedding? King. Kill him! Kill him now! Lord al -Hazred, with all due respect, you are not quite king yet. And this is a wedding ceremony, not an execution. What? How dare you contradict me, you flea-bitten mongrel! I gave a direct order. Obey me, or feel my wrath! Milady, I apologize for my behavior, but I am yours to command in all things. I wanted merely to hear your own wishes from your own lips. Tell me what it is that you wish me to do with this young man, and I will obey. Why, Captain, you heard my dear Abdul. If he wishes this atrocious young man's death, then I want nothing more than to see him get his wish. Obey thy liege now and always. As you oh. wish, princess. Oh, you heard her. <laughs> Just as Saladin prepares to run Alexander through with his sword, a shout is heard from the direction of the Grand Hall. Hold! 
Jallo. Oh. Uh, I thought it was Jallo too. <laughs> <laughs> King Stop Coffin. the wedding! Stop the wedding! <laughs> looking alive and well, and full of wrath. Behind them, a line of supporters look prepared to battle, if necessary, for their beloved royal couple. It's just the book keep. Okay, one sec, let's get over there. <laughs> Darling, are you alright? Has he hurt you? Hands off of her, you murderous goat! If I want your advice, I'll ask for it, mother. But, Califim, that's not Cosima. I'd know my daughter anywhere. What have you done with our daughter, you devil? The lovely image of Cosima suddenly bursts into smoke and is replaced by the Wazir's genie. Ah. <gasps> Why? Aw, they're getting married to each other. Yeah. Get him, guards. Saladin, your sword. Drat it all. You may have ruined my plans, but you won't get me or your precious Kasima. Get them, Shamir! I command you! He's getting away! Stop him! Yes, sire! As soon as I deal with this genie! Well, never mind. I can go get him. <laughs> so, um, if you didn't go to the Land of the Dead, you obviously wouldn't have the parents to be like, That's not Kasima! Mm -hmm. Um, but you would still have the mirror from the beast. So you would show, you would um, use the mirror on Cosima, and it would show that it's really the genie. Oh, uh, cool. I'll save it again. Oop, still simping. <laughs> Important. <laughs> Shamir, the wazir's genie, begins to throw balls of dazzling light at the guard dogs. Oh no. They'll be oh. fine. Okay. Follow the vizier. Okay. Yep, totally <laughs> fine. Don't <laughs> worry. <laughs> Guy falls dead. If you're there by after the third one falls, he'll kill you next. So it's like a little 15 second timer to get out of there. Alexander, no. be careful. Al Hazard has a sword. Shut up, wench. Shamir Shamazel, get in here. Here I am. Kabuzel Kabazel. It's about time, you bumbling fool! How could you let him follow me? Well, there were the guard dogs, master, and then... Never mind! Just kill him! Kill him now! <sighs> As you wish, master. Okay. Razzle, dazzle, snap and snazzle! Alexander, I did it! <laughs> I swapped the legs! <laughs> he just waddles up the Rest stairs at the wrong time. Now get clear, friend. No argument there, my lord. Good luck! Hi, Kasima! Hi, Kasima, by the way! Uh, you want to use the lamp on him now? Congrats. Congratulations on the wedding! Shamir Shamazel, hold your spells. I am your master now. I order you to go back into your lamp. How did you get my lamp? You thief! You... You... You've ruined me! My lamp! Oh, thank Balhalla! I hated working for that loathsome creature. I already feel his nastiness leaving me. How I've longed for a master like you. Hmm. Well, it, it, don't be weird. Just get in the bottle. <laughs> So, um, if you picked the wrong lamp, never made a relationship with Jalo because all the Jalo things are completely optional. You don't need Jalo at all. So oh. you could get here, go into his room, and he'd be like, who are you? Um, but still be friendly, um, but but completely not know you. Um, so he wouldn't help you with the lamp. Um, so yeah, keep the pause real quick. Um, so how you... As well, Alexander. I can't, because it, it started to... But I the am the master. If you didn't have a relationship sword, with Jalo, or you didn't get your own short path, is you shall have the and lamp. Kind of get so, so shall it be, I don't need the genie like to deal with the coward like you. you. Mm. Yeah. Uh, grab the sword off the wall. Grab the sword? Off the wall. Yeah. Off the wall. Inspiration. Alexander fixes upon the only weapon in sight. Sounds. 
Alexander, never wielding a sword in his life. <laughs> Good. Then you shall only fail sooner, my prince. Attack. So, the mouse would bite? This mouse shall bite, as you shall soon see. Or should I say, soon feel? Oh, ho, ho. Ha! You can barely lift that sword, my prince. Better to lay it down now. I promise to dispatch you with little pain. A tempting offer. But I think I'll wait and see you what this sword can do. Suit yourself. Is that tempting? Hmm. Oh, he was he was taunting him, I see. Okay. <laughs> uh, who's the king? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Which one? Shoot him. I'm the king. No, shoot him. I'm the real king. There she goes. Alexander's arms start to tremble under the effort of wielding a huge sword. His muscles are nearing exhaustion. It's gotten a lot harder to hear you, Ryan. Uh, if you did not give her the dagger, so she wouldn't ends. get out of her. Not she wouldn't be tired. Help it. Got it. Oh, that makes sense. Kasima and he would thrust right the there. small dagger into Alhazred's shoulder with all her might. <laughs> you, nah. you dare raise a finger to me? You will regret that, princess. Yeah. Donk. Oh, kill. I'm just gonna walk away, not tie him up or anything. Kasima. Leaving him right? both swords. I'm fine, Alexander. Yeah. I was just so afraid for you. There's no need to fear anymore, princess. Yes, I know. How can I ever repay you for myself, for my kingdom? It was oh, not in to let harm come to you. Can you I mean, your parents are back, so... ...to give me more than your gratitude? Alexander! What? What are you saying? I love exactly. you, Kasima. Would you Wanna go get consider... a bite? Do you think you could... ...marry me? Could you ever have doubted it, my prince? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, uh -huh. What what now, Jallo? Oh. Oh, guards. <laughs> Princess Kasima, are you well? I'm quite well, thank you. Please take Abdul and put him in the dungeon. See to it that he gets a doctor. Yes, Majesty. How's Megabyte? But Is he okay? They didn't even tie him up. Well, I guess I I'll there leave. he goes. He could have just taken one of the other swords and started fighting his way out. <laughs> <laughs> With good dogs. Meanwhile, and Alexander also, Saladin to if you did it the short way, no one is here except <laughs> King Graham, the Queen, except for Alexander's family. No one else is here. Do we get to see King Graham and his rippling muscles, or is this the most we'll see of them? I think this is the most we see. Uh, looks like he dyed his hair, too. Yeah. Do you, Prince Alexander of Daventry, take Princess Cosima to be your wife? <laughs> he doesn't look very sure about it. No. Well, I don't know. <laughs> I do. I mean... He's the one who forced himself through this thing. Yeah. To just to marry her. Like, you can't even... At least woo her a little bit, I yeah. suppose. But again, again, she's... So, he's, he's, you wanna get married? Gotta... Yeah, sure. Do you have a ring? Yeah. I have Alexander's royal insignia ring. Very good. Oh, shit. Please I don't have a ring. ring on Cosima's finger. Who gives this bride to be wed? Oh, that dog lived. I willingly give our daughter's hand in wedlock. Who will speak for the groom? I will. Alexander's oh, there he is. and I recognize his marriage to Princess Cosimo with glad hearts and sanction this union. Then, Alexander and Cosima, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> Hooray! Hooray! 
Yay. Congratulations, so. <laughs> my children. I have an important question for you both. Please hear me. Yes, sire? Alexander, I welcome you into our family with open arms. I place trust in Alhazred because I so badly wanted a son and a husband for my beloved daughter. Oh, for your daughter. Okay. I was wrong. But you are <laughs> true and good, Alexander. You have proven yourself to all my people. What? Thank you. She could have ruled. Maria and I have been through Oh, thank goodness we don't have to leave it to a woman. Yeah, oh. right. <laughs> I do not think we are able I was so worried even in death. Will you two consider the crown? I know as king and queen, you can heal the small kingdom. <laughs> Graham and his and wife are like, yes, finally, we don't have to have them back. Oh, yeah. oh, they're like, this is better than we could have ever expected. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I thought for sure he'd be dead. <laughs> Alexander, I would be happy to stay and serve it all my days. Father, I believe I'm needed here. Would you be very disappointed? No, no, get out of here. Stay. Son, yeah. You must follow your destiny. I do believe the land of the Green Isles needs you. You'll be a magnificent king, though dearly missed in Daventry. Then... <laughs> I accept. But not Devon Tree Castle. Boy, what nope. a man you've become. And how I will miss you. Don't worry, mother. With Sisters standing are like, okay, bye. Visit often. <laughs> I'm not about to forget my family. Mm, are you? Congratulations, oh, Alexander. Sister. I'm so proud of you. Thank you, dear sister. Oh, Alexander, I'm so glad. Between the return of my beloved parents and our new reign, you've made me so happy. I'm glad I could make up for some of your suffering, my beautiful wife. Congratulations, King Alexander. When we return home to Daventry, your crew will be glad to hear that their battle at sea was worthwhile in bringing forth... He reminds me of Microsoft Sam. So he kind of does, yeah. <laughs> without you, son. I'm so thankful that you are safe and happy. And I am as grateful that my crew did not pay for my driven heart. You have only brought us all good fortune, sire. With Shamir saved and his power used for good, reuniting the islands will be far easier. He has already repaired the ferry. Your road will be easier now that the islands are no longer feuding. Already the wounds are starting to heal. Yes, my love. Discovering the island's stolen treasures has done more to bring peace to this land than anything else. It is now clear that Alhazred had Shamir steal each of the island's most valued treasures, then blame the thefts on others to cause the islands to hate each other. Now let us celebrate our good fortune. The evil that has plagued this land is done, and a new reign begins. Long live King Alexander and Queen Cosima. Long live King Alexander! Long live Queen Cosima! For some Long reason I thought Jalo dies, but I guess not. No! <laughs> I don't think there's ever one where Jalo dies. Hooray! 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 Jalo breakdances in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> that, you just made me remember that awful um, Alice in Wonderland remake they did. Johnny Depp. <laughs> they made two of them. That dance. I completely oh, forgot they did weird. a dance thing. Yeah. I forgot they, they even named it. Yeah. yeah. Are we really getting credits without music? But what happens next time on King's Quest 7? Look at Jello. Look at how big his jaw is. Yeah. True <laughs> yeah. to life. This uh, is really weird. I don't remember end credits being so... Uh, oh, the genie is there. Yeah. Yeah. We own the genie now. I know, I just, I didn't see him. He was like blending into the carpet. Shamir Shamazel. Hold on. Because I want to make sure we got all our points. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to get content ID'd. That's fine. 
So that's King's Quest Six. Mm-hmm. King's Quest Seven is okay. So King's Quest Seven is is more like a hand drawn cartoon, yeah, style. Um, and it is also very. It's more of the a, a Queen's Quest. Yep. It's like opposite King's Quest Two. It's the girls, both uh, the Princess Rosella and Queen Valenice. Um, it's chapters switching in between the two of them, and. It, Overall, it's a story of how to get Princess Rosella a uh, husband. It's her quest to find her king. Mm-hmm. Um, and we are not doing that one. Right. But um, that, that whole one, um, besides being illustrated like that, is like, just kind of imagine the Isle of Wonder times 10. That whole game is kind of like down because I can. Sometimes Ugh. it sounds like you're getting kind of muddy there, Ryan. I don't know what to say about that. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's no fun. <laughs> um, yeah, the whole game is. Oh, like, everything. Uh, like references to like cartoons and like the Hell of Sportsman in one of them, and like things like that. Yeah. Um, I've seen a small bit of it. I think on Retro Prank, actually. Um, I don't know that they finished it though, but um, yeah, that doesn't seem. I'm not super interested in it. No, um, no, it's, these are the two of my favorite King's Quests. Um, the others, four is good. Um, it is Princess Rosella again. One and two are just a little too elementary, like you know, old time game. Yeah, or early kind of sixteen bit. Um. Maybe even I think they're I think Kings Plus One and Two are eight bit actual. Um, there you go. One hundred percent. Yeah. Nice. Um, easily easy. Back to the point just before the Druids brainstorm. Yeah. Don't go back to see the Druids. Instead, head to the castle. <laughs> see? And that's where they're telling you there's another how to get the other end. But you get so much less. Ugh, my Discord's acting up. One second. Um. There we go. Hey, Ryan, do you have headphones on? No, but there's a fan blowing directly at my face. One second. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> um. Yeah, so that's uh, King's Quest Six. Um. I like the, I I I think I like that better than five. Yeah, I do too. And that's I think the general consensus is that people like six better than five. It is a it is a better game for sure. Mm-hmm. Uh, there are a lot more a lot more optional things. Like it felt like in King's Quest Five, like everything that you did, you needed to do. Yep. Um, a lot more optional things in King's Quest Six. Um, two different endings, which is kind of cool. Yeah. Also, I liked how um, not everyone can show up at the end at the celebration. That's neat. Yeah, the kind of branching path kind of a thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, I, I think you could open the magical door with Ali Zibu. Or, or not, maybe. But yeah, I think on the short path, you never get the islands to realize that the, the vizier stole all their stuff. Like, but yeah, neat. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Good game. Yeah. Um, next Tuesday, though, is Nuts and Bolts. Banjo-Kazooie, Nuts and Bolts. Ooh. I'm excited for that. 